First of all, apply eyeshadow base all over my lid. I use Essence. I love Stage. I love this one especially because don't crease and um, also I use it sometimes like concealer because it's skin color. And right now I'm gonna first line and do it my crease. But right now I'm gonna do it a little bit different. I'm gonna go like this. Like this. Next I'm gonna take the eye pencil and kind of a little bit fill inside this corner and right here to do not go up because right now it's going to start the other colors just right here and next what I'm gonna do it's take just small eyeshadow brush and smudge to do not have very strong line For the eyeshadows today I'm gonna use this palette. I find this palette and I really really like it. For all products which I use in this video you will find in my blog down below. And I will gonna have a giveaway for this palette and also a few things next week. Or maybe, yes, next week. And check out the Twitter and blog to find more updates for that. I love this eyeshadow, it's very very shimmery, very very beautiful, but also it's very gorgeous to use like wet eyeshadows. And today I'm gonna use wet and dry. I'm gonna use Sigma Concealer F70 brush and I'm gonna create the black one. I will gonna have on the block all the products which I use. I love the eyeshadows, it's very very creamy and also you can use wet and dry, it's very pigmented and also beautiful colors and very shimmery eyeshadows. Ok, next color is going to be in the second row, this beautiful gorgeous kind of looks like white but definitely have golden sheen into it and I'm gonna press this right here now we go with the fun part we start first I'm gonna use this like burgundy reddish color with pencil brush E30 brush and right now I'm gonna go and put that to out the part right now I use it wet but also you can use like I said wet if you use wet it's more it's going to be more intensity colors Go around your eye, don't blend yet with the black, just around like this. 
And also, you will need to go and you're done apart. All over it. Right now it looks messy, but in the seconds this is going to be beautiful look. That is reddish color. Right now and I'm gonna go with this kind of orangey color and I'm gonna take this angle brush by Sigma it's E70 brush and put um kind of to blend and create radiant effect. To do not be one color stopped another color. Oh my gosh, I love this color. Really, really love this one. The orange one. Now I'm going to go with the black and kind of smudge this out the line. Now we need yellow eyeshadow and put that into the highlight and blend with the orange eyeshadow. And again, go with the white with golden rough wax and kind of go right here. Now we go with the black one, put a little bit more, and also I'm gonna blend a little bit. Now I'm gonna take a shimmery, I already put a red eyeliner on my, how it's called, brows. And right now I'm gonna go with shimmery white and I'm gonna place right here on my down lid. I'm kind of blend with the black a little bit to do not be super harsh. Like this. And again, I will go with the yellow and I'm gonna put on top. Next is shimmer white and put right here. A little bit. And because I want to be sparkly from the fire, I'm going to put a red glitter right here. The eyes, you can wear it, not every day, but you can definitely wear it. But the brows, it's not going to be wearable. wearable. And because of that, I want to create even more kind of effect. I'm going to put a lash glue on my brows and go with this kind of 
sparkly glitters and put If you need, you can put more lash glue to kind of stick the product Oops. into the brow. Like that, and on the end, I will gonna put a um, golden one, which is going to create that light of fire. The red one is more bigger. The gold one is more smaller. If you take it, the glitter on this part up here and also the eyebrows, this is kind of a wearable look, but for this tutorial I want to do this kind of look. Break in the color. And on top of that, like blush, I'm gonna use a red, very rich red color. If you don't have blush red, you can use eyeshadow for that. Oh my god, this here weak it's so annoying on top of that I will gonna use yellow eyeshadow the same like the eyes it's not huge difference between like to create like fire on this part For my lips, I already put a nude uh, lip liner. You can go with the red, but I think it's already too much for the eyes and the cheeks and the uh, lips. I wanted to keep it nude. And I'm gonna use this beautiful coralish color. And also I think I'm gonna do, into the giveaway, I'm gonna pop, put few colors of this because these lip glosses are awesome smell so divine so pigmented and smell like bubble gums I love the smell I like the colors I like the texture texture of this it's not sticky at all it's shiny and very beautiful lip gloss And this is my Hunger Games, kind of my first tutorial.
If you wanted to see more like this inspired tutorials, let me know. This is my tutorial for today. Looks like this. I love the lip gloss. It's very, very creamy and more it's like lipstick than lip gloss. Love it. And yes, if you like this tutorial, keep thumbs up and subscribe, comment and yes, thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. See ya. Bye-bye.